Welcome to the program. I'm Mark Imperial. This segment's being brought to you by booksgrowbusiness.com. It's the place where busy entrepreneurs, professionals, and business owners publish to grow their businesses and to leave a legacy. We're doing a series of spotlights on remarkable experts from across the country and even in your own backyard. Joining me on this segment is Shannon Southwick, and she's the founder of Bigger Change. Shannon, welcome to the program. Hi, thank you so much for having me. Shannon, tell us a little bit about Bigger Change and who are the types of clients and folks that you help? Awesome, I'd love to. Uh, so Bigger Change, um, we are a company that focuses on a digital health and fitness approach. Uh, and we get our clients results holistically through what we call the Bigger Change formula. Uh, essentially, what the Bigger Change formula is, is we want to teach you how to get sustainable results that will last a lifetime. And we don't just want to tell you what to do. Um, so we take a four-step approach into our bigger change formula and that covers fitness, nutrition. It also gives you an extra step of daily accountability. And we add something called habit reformation where this is really where we focus on those core values that really will uh, make or break your lifestyle that you're trying to create. So again, we're trying to create a lifestyle for you, help you create the best lifestyle for yourself and not just give you a quick fix. So when folks reach out to you and find you, what do you find their biggest challenge is? Is there a, a commonality you find in a lot of your clients that uh, maybe keep them stuck? Absolutely. There is, there does seem to be some um, commonalities across clients. A few of those are that people just feel overwhelmed with how much they have on their plates. There's no time, no time to do anything. Uh, and also with the given circumstances we've been in for the last year, um, no need to say what it's been, but uh, given those circumstances, people have found themselves having additional responsibilities and lifestyle changes that they just weren't quite expecting and didn't know how to adjust with. Uh, so being busy, being overwhelmed are very common uh, feelings that people get, but they also have this common voice inside them that they hear telling them that they can do more and that they can have that life they want. They're just missing that extra little piece. What frustrates them? Like, do you find people that have tried, you know, overcoming their challenges on their own and, and they can't quite get any results? What frustrates them or keeps them stuck? I think we've all been in that position at one time or another when we're trying to accomplish something in our life and it is just difficult to uh, make it click and to get those results. And so I do find that uh, people often um, become very, uh, you know, lost with what they're supposed to do. They have tried these more template-like formulas. They Google things on the internet. They try something they saw on Instagram. They've been following this diet that somebody they follow does, and they're just not quite getting the results. And the reason being is because those aren't made specifically for them and their lifestyle. And we all have our own things going on in our life that having somebody who's really on our side and knows how to help you navigate those waters of life uh, is is the difference of how you'll succeed and how you won't. You mentioned some myths and misconceptions out there, people following things for maybe the wrong reasons. W what are some of the like bigger, um, you know, uh, myths or misconceptions you see people following out there that you might want to steer them away from? Well, it's hard to just give some common misconceptions or myths because different things work for different people different things work for different lifestyles. So some popular things going on right now might be intermittent fasting or a keto diet. Uh, these are things that people come to me all the time asking about, wanting to know about the Whole30, uh, things that they've seen somebody have success with, the carnivore diet. You know, there's all these different things that uh, people, it might be right for some people, but the bottom line is, just because it works for one person doesn't mean it's going to work for you. So knowing what you need, what your body needs is really, is really key. How do you determine that? How does one find what works for them? Is there a, a formula for that? Absolutely. 
Um, so when it comes to finding, you know, really what's best for you, I always encourage people to, if you're trying to solve a problem, no matter what the problem is in life, let's say your sink is broken and the garbage disposal doesn't work and you're not a plumber and you don't know what to do. You can try and get in there and you can try and fix things. You can look at certain things online, try and figure it out, but it will take a lot longer. You probably won't get the results you're looking for. They probably won't last either. Um, so you should probably reach out to a professional. So that's one thing I really encourage people, even if it's just to talk and get advice, always reach out to somebody who is a professional in, especially when it comes to your health and fitness, what you're trying to do. Uh, additionally, you got it, when you're working with a professional, a lot of the times our system too is taking what we know has worked for people in similar situations, similar backgrounds, and also implying what you specifically like and don't like, what your specific lifestyle is, we start with the program, but we're always ready to adjust. A little bit of trial and error is, is going to be key in really uh, figuring out what's best for you. You can't just try one thing if it doesn't work. Oh, I knew I couldn't get It's not meant for me. I can't do it. So, so, so Shannon, you mentioned your methodologies and you mentioned some transformation habits that you help them with. Can you kind of give us a little, you know, maybe 10,000 foot view of the process that it, it that what's it, it's like working with you? Yeah. So there's a, I can, I can try and, and sum it up, but uh, to start each, each person who comes to work uh, with us at Bigger Change is gonna get something that's individualized and custom just for them when they choose to do one-on-one -on -one coaching. We do have some templates and some free resources that people can start with that are gonna be great. But again, the key to really getting sustainable real results is knowing what's, what's best for you. So when people come to us, they're going to get a custom program link. There's no one size fits all. Not everyone's going to have a 12 week, 24 week, 64 week. It's all going to depend on what an individual needs, first of all. Um, secondly, every program is going to start with a habit reformation, because if we don't check our habits, our daily patterns, our thought patterns, and what we're doing constantly we're not gonna get results 64 weeks down the road if we're constantly thinking the same things, doing the same things that have kept us where we have been for however long that may be. So starting off our program with a 12 week habit reformation where we start it and then we consistently go over those habits that we've set, those goals that we've set throughout the entire length of the program. Um, some habits that we really focus on that really make a difference are gonna be a lot of mindset training when it comes to uh, meditation and affirmations, talking, talking good to yourself when it comes to foods and our relationships with foods, why we eat them, how we eat them. So there's sleep that takes it plays a huge role in how we are and how we treat ourselves at night before we go to bed in the morning, how we treat up ourselves during our morning routine before we start our day. So there's really a lot that goes into it again. So the main things are you know, getting your nutrition, getting your fitness, addressing your mindset, and having a coach that is with you every step of the way every day. I appreciate that overview. Shannon, how did you get started? And what inspired you to start Bigger Change? I love this question, because we all have a story of why we're doing what we're doing. Um, for me, it is a, a very uh, hard story sometimes to talk about just because it has to do with health. Uh, so about 10 years ago, I was in a very bad car accident that left me with injuries that the doctors told me that I would never be able to live an active life. Uh, I was in a wheelchair for almost an entire year, uh, a walker, a body brace, you know, told given all of these, you're never going to walk normal again. You know, you're going to need to take these medications and it was really hard. I was, I was a senior in high school when most of that was happening. And then out of high school, going into college and having a bunch of surgeries and just really in a bad place. And I didn't, everything I thought I was going to do, I now couldn't, and I needed to, to readjust. So what ended up happening is I had just that voice that I talked about at the beginning inside me, something just telling me you can do more there's, there's more you can be doing. And although these doctors have told you, you can't be active. I had never joined a gym. I'd never been to a gym. So I just decided 
I'm going to just go to a gym and I'm going to join because even if I can just sit on a bike and ride it, like I do in physical therapy, at least I'm doing something. So that's where I started. And uh, one thing led to another. I got inspired at the gym uh, with posters I saw on the wall for fitness competitions. And I decided that is how I'm going to prove to these doctors, to this situation, to myself, that I can really, I can do something. I can do more. I can do more than the limitations that have been put on me or maybe that I've even put on myself. And so I started training for these competitions and I started winning and it felt great. And then people wanted to know how I did it, how I went from being in a wheelchair to being on stage winning trophies. And I wanted to help people. So I just started helping people for free. They started getting great results and told me, Shannon, like, you can't be helping us for free. We need to pay you. And the idea was just came, this is what I'm supposed to be doing. This needs to be my business. I need to help other people too realize no matter what circumstances they've been given, no matter what limitations have been put on them, they can grow from it. They can do more. Uh, they can find their bigger change within themselves. I love that. What an amazing story and, and how serendipitous that you find your purpose from the from that adventure. Uh, Shannon, for folks listening that can resonate with your message and, and could definitely use help, um, how do they find you, learn more and connect with you? Absolutely. I would love for people to connect with me anytime. I, I read all my emails, my messages. I love to connect. A couple of different ways you can reach out to me. One being social media. I'm on Instagram at Bigger Change. You can send me a message. You can follow me there. I do put a lot of content up um, daily. Also, I have a website, biggerchange.com. My email is in there. There's contact forms way to get a hold of me directly through there. There's also a lot of great resources and free content that you can get on my website as well. So if you're just wanting to even know more about health and fitness, what is this all about? What is a holistic approach to health and fitness look like? Uh, there's a lot of things on the website that can help you. And my email is shannon at biggerchange.com. So again, feel free to reach out to me and I would love to, I would love to connect. Shannon, this has been terrific. I really appreciate your insights and taking the time to share with my audience today. I wish you continued success for you and for all of your clients. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much, Mark. Shannon Southwick, founder of Bigger Change. This segment's been brought to you by booksgrowbusiness.com. It's the place where busy entrepreneurs, professionals, and business owners publish to grow their businesses and to leave a legacy. That's all for now. I'm Mark Imperial, and thanks for tuning in.